Hi stamping friends, I'm Karina with KarinasCreations.com and I got this super cute swap that, at an event I just ran and this card uses the Lighthearted Leaf stamp set and the leaf Leaflets Framelit dies and I just wanted to show you how to create this fun back background really quick. I'm actually changing my card a bit but I just wanted to show you this one and show you the technique. Now I like to use the thick white cardstock. It's a little bit heavier than our Whisper White cardstock. This is what it looks like in Whisper White. It still works, but I find it kind of buckles at the back. So by using the thick white cardstock, that won't happen. So you need to grab an Aqua Painter, and with the Aqua Painter, when you unscrew it, you put the water in this end and tighten it back up. And then I like to just put a little bit of water in my hand, make sure it's working. And then I'm going to use Sahara Sand ink. And when you squeeze the top of the ink pad, it creates a pool of ink like that. And then I'm just going to pick up the color. I'll put it this way. You may not be able to see the ink, but you'll be able to see what I'm doing. And make sure it's fairly wet. And then all I'm doing, lining up on my grid paper, and I'm just going across creating a line and it didn't quite catch on this side and then I'll do it again over here and I'm putting quite a bit of pressure when you put more pressure on the aqua painter you get a thicker line but this is so fun I can see using this technique for lots of different things and if you don't like the look of the line you just go back and do it again I'm actually turning this card into my stamp set of the month. So my stamp set of the month club is $30.95 and you either get three hand stamped cards or you get the pieces to make the cards with all the instructions and there's usually one video every month too. And it's great if you live in Canada and you like stamping at home and want some techniques to try. Okay so that's what the background looks like now and like I said this is what the card that I got in the swap, so I think it's super cute, and I hope you'll try this technique. Happy stamping!